Hello there guys and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 2 Apartment Life and I just wanted to show you guys real quick what the family photo looks like and how much it's grown since the beginning when it was just Bob and Tracy so here we have like the entire family and I think it's cute and I think it's about time we change this description I have no description for this random crazy family because um yeah your mom just wanted to add now we're the Duggars cool and we're just gonna go ahead and go into game. Okay, so it is 3 a.m. in game, but I just wanted to point out Bob just got back from work, and yes, he finally reached the top of the paranormal career track. So it says Bob has been promoted to cult leader. Your legendary powers are now known far and wide, from this world to the next, and Sims from around the globe flock to hear your wisdom and live by your word. Just try not to believe all uh, your own PR or soon your devoted flock will stop gazing at your golden aura and stop pecking at your feet of clay. Bob now works from 6 to 3 starting immediately and Bob brought home 5,000 with a bonus of 14,000. So you know what that vacation home seems a lot closer than it was before. Alrighty, so it is morning and the family is still up doing whatever the heck it was that they were doing before, I guess. I don't know. And what is going on? Um, the paper guy is living our paper to the back of the house for some strange reason. Okay, so we're gonna recycle this, uh, recycle this, because we don't actually care about the Sims newspaper, like, ever. Is there a way I can set the front door's door to the front of the house? Because, it's weird. That's really weird. It's like the girls have their own subscription to something. But you can stop playing the dang violin all the damn time, Curious. I can't with you. Can't with you. I'm gonna sell your crappy painting for three dollars that uh, <laughs> Ignis messed up. And let's have you paint something else before you go to school. Just because. What is Ignis doing? She is cleaning up the trash that I told her to do. Cool. Um... <laughs> Don't you guys see Bob is trying to watch TV? Rude! Turn this dang thing off. This is like really loud. <laughs> oh gosh, turn it off. She's like, Bob, what are you doing? And then she's like, oh, screw you, gotta go to school. Bye, peasants. <laughs> oh gosh, Apollo, the ignored child of the family. Speaking of children, how are these two thingies doing? They should be aging up today. But before that, I want to have the entire family after school head out to a restaurant and go out to eat together. Lord knows managing a family this large on a uh, food outing is very difficult, I know. But we're going to try it anyway. We're going to actually drive this car for once because we never really use it. So, Tracy, can you actually stop begging for Bob's attention and go do something? <laughs> let's clean up the house. Let's take care of some of the children here. None of them are sleeping, so I guess we can... um. Play with Weevee, uh, check on Weevee, cuddle, come on, do a few things around the house that a mother would do, eh? And she ages up in 15 days, I think Bob is the same. Yeah, and the girls are going to college soon, which is super crazy to think, but I can't believe it. And that will be the start of our new LP, which you guys will be seeing. I will be ending this LP around that time. It's not that we're not gonna see this family anymore, like Bob Jr. and, um, Weavy, but you know things have got to move forward the LP has to end somewhere and yeah <laughs> um, that's what I'm gonna end up doing the same thing is gonna be for open for business I think I'm gonna extend open for business just a little longer than apartment life but I feel like we've kind of gotten to the point of this LP I said I was gonna make some switches and all that stuff but that's a whole lot of work and I'm thinking I'm thinking I'm just gonna make a certain similar witch just one. Just one. And hold up. Sims- yeah, they can't- they can have lifetime rewards? No way. No way. So what if her aspiration's really bad and we use this thingy, Merbobber? What will that do? Because I'm actually very curious. And she didn't do her homework. God, Apollo, you're gonna fail out of school. Do you want to fail out of school? I think she wants to. And she has lifetime things, but I remember I said I wasn't going to waste that. Does anyone else? Yeah, they do. He has four. We're going to put this all under needs because I don't care enough about work for him anymore. Or maybe I should go back. What is this? 
This interaction is available on all telescopes. Will allow you to attempt hitching a ride from any flying saucers. Ooh boy, ooh boy, 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 boy. We're doing that. Um, gonna go here. Let's see what else can she do. She has one. She only has one, and she doesn't need anything about work anymore. So there's slow hunger, slow hunger, slow hunger, hunger, hunger. Slow need, decay, fun, and hunger. So I guess we'll do that because hunger is a little, mmm, it's really irritating in this game. So that's all she can do. What about the girls? The girls still have their choices, but I'm going to wait till college to, I guess, change anything under theirs. So there's nothing predetermined in the other LP. And that's really it because we can't choose crap for babies. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to age up the children. In this part, the little toddlers, so we can see what they're doing. Or, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, don't get this. Sorry if I'm disturbing anyone with that voice, by the way. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna take our telescope, put it outside, and Bob, you are gonna do something special. Summon aliens! Heck yes! Heck yes, Bob, yes! Come on. And we have weeds in the front. Nice to know this family's starting a weed garden. I, oh, okay, that sounded terrible. <laughs> I didn't mean it that way, guys. I didn't mean it that way, I swear. But we're gonna have Bob clean up, or not Bob clean up weeds, Tracy, because these weeds in this game, like, they terrify me. Like, I don't know why, but they give me chills. I mean, I don't know. But here he is, summoning some aliens. A aliens. If it were this easy to summon aliens. Really. I, I don't see any, Bob. I'm, I'm really not seeing any of them right now. I guess they're not gonna find a Bob. I'm sorry. Did I really just waste the lifetime reward points on this? Oh god. Okay, well. Sorry about that, Bob. Nothing too big. Nothing too big. No. All right. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to leave that be. What is Tracy doing? She's oh, she's actually doing something around the house. Good. The girls didn't do their homework because why didn't they? Why are you not in school, you little peasant child? If they lose their scholarships, I swear. I swear, encourage you. you uh, okay, I had to say it is my fault. Okay, it is my fault. You're not gonna. You're not gonna play the damn violin. You are not. Go, go, freaking water the money tree. Now that you're ready home, I can't with curious anymore. I can't. My dog's barking, so I'm gonna stop recording right now, and I'll be. Hello, hello. Oh, I just got a thing on Facebook. Yeah, I still use Facebook. I feel you judging me. I feel it. <laughs> but anyway, um, moving forward, I was thinking about something, and I'm not sure many of you would approve of this. But maybe I'll just make Bob a wizard. I don't know how you guys would feel about that, but I was really thinking maybe that would be a good idea. Like, it wouldn't be that bad of a thing. So... Tell me what you guys think about that so we actually can show off the witch features and all that kind of stuff. And it's not a permanent thing either because we can just um call the lady over to the lady, what's her name? I, I don't know what she is, the matchmaker I think. And you could just ask her and she'll help. But So since you stayed home today, Curious, you're going to do Ignis' homework. And where's your homework? That's a really great, great question. I'm assuming it's actually on the desk out back. Or it's not. It could be in the child's room upstairs. But, oh my god, one of the children is on the floor. Put in crib. Weavy. Because I know that's Weavy. I know Tracy totally just... Totally just did that. But it says, Ignis is horsing around with some classmates one afternoon. Oh, the football... See, now she was recognized for the football thing. That's what happened when Ignis doesn't go to school. And I'm assuming this is Curious's actual homework. Because her grades are slowly slipping because peasant... You know what? You're not gonna do your sister's homework. She's gonna do her own, and as soon as she gets home, she'll do hers. At least it's like, at least maybe one per- Oh! Nope, not a percent done. Cool. Just wanna wait for her. Hey, Tracy. Is curious of- Oh, yes she is! 
is boo yes she is yes yes okay so your the phone is here for you yeah go pick it up <laughs> but what you're gonna do first thing ignis you didn't do your homework yesterday and that's what you're gonna end up doing now because you didn't do it before so cool looks like a member of your household brought a new video game how many times have i seen this i'm not <laughs> i'm not gonna Done. So done. So, can we go out for dinner now? Actually, oh, Apollo is not home. I forgot about Apollo. I forgot about Apollo. Oh my God. Are right, you? So you talked on the phone with him already. Stop playing kicky back. Si kicky back sideways with your mother. That's what I meant to say. And I'll go do some homework. Is God. God, Ignis. You can't do anything right. You can't do anything right, Ignis. Come on. I mean, curious. Oh, dang it. I was calling her. You guys are always yelling at me in the comments because I can never get their names right, and I understand why now. The whole last part, I was calling Tracy Nikki. Nikki. I probably did it a few times in this part. I think Bob and John are the only people I have not mixed up yet. And we still haven't summoned aliens. I think this was a waste of one of those lifetime things. But it's okay. Go pay the bills or something. That's redeeming enough, right? Uh, bills? No? Sorry. Yesterday I was at my friend's wedding and I actually had to give a speech. <laughs> like, I didn't have to, but I, I did. And that was interesting because I was pretty much, like, very sa sassy the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> So it was weird. I don't know. I guess it was because I was nervous, so I was just like very jokeful about everything I said. Because I don't like speaking in front of people. YouTube's different because <laughs> I'm behind a screen. I don't gotta look at any of you. But <laughs> I see. I'm sassy now. But it's kind of different when you're actually in front of people. You get really nervous and all this other crap. And I don't know. But here we go. We're gonna have to have our kids try to make up their grades here. And then right after that, you're gonna go do something. Did she actually go to work? No, damn it. Damn it, Tracy. Damn it. You were supposed to go out for dinner today. Tracy. Uh huh. <laughs> she ruined this part's plans, guys. She ruined this part's plans. All right, well, fine. I'm not gonna let this get in my way. Just drop the babies on the floor like it's Michael Jackson and we're gonna call someone up. We are gonna call a witch. And we are going to invite her over, befriend her, all this fun stuff. I think since it's a family friend, it'll work fine. But let's see. Uh, we're gonna call. Oh no, we can't call the witch. Meow, why? Why? Dang it. Alright, so we're gonna have Bob go out by himself today. Go somewhere. Put the baby back on the floor, Bob. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. And we're gonna go. I will see you guys when we're at a public lot looking for some witches. Alright, so I'm at a community lot, alright? And there's this sim I made because I have problems, right? Right? Look at the name. <laughs> if you guys have been to my live streams, you know enough. So I'm gonna go ahead and have him buy groceries. And we're honestly gonna just be on like a kind of stake out here waiting for a witch to show up. We have a few other recognizable characters. Like we have Juliet Lincolns who always shops at our business and open for business and all that fun stuff. Let's just buy all the groceries we can get. Yeah, let's go to- Of course we're gonna go to the register that's super crowded. Poor chick over here, like, completely ignored. <laughs> <laughs> That's so depressing, and she was closer to where he was shopping too. So like, poor thing. Damn it, uh, Zoe. Zoe Kimbrell. I'm sorry. We had to just go shop with this guy. So we're gonna buy some more. I can buy more. I can just like infinitely buy groceries. Yeah, I'm gonna buy more. I'm gonna buy more. You better believe it. Oh boy, boy, boy. What if I shop from this? Do I still have to go to um, that guy? Because I kind of want to. I want to buy something from Zoe. I feel very bad. So we're gonna. We're gonna go here. Yeah, there we go. Oh look, Zoe, hey, girl. I felt bad. I felt bad. She's like, oh thank you. You're my first purchase today. Are you trying to say something about Bob? Are you trying to say something? Um. 
Okay, so I really, really, really want a witch to show up, but if one doesn't, I'll be sad. I will honestly be sad. I know this chick knows some witches, but whatever. There's We're gonna go oh, here. This woman wants to greet us. Alright, let's entertain you with a joke. Let's see. Can you summon a witch for us? Can you make one show up? We've kind of been waiting for one for a while. And we want one now. We want witches and we want them now. We want witches and we want them now. Let's, um, let's talk and hang out. You'll be our entertainment for the next few sim hours. So please, please don't bore us beyond all things. And we're just gonna sit here. Literally, this is gonna be the most least entertaining part of the <laughs> apartment life ever because we are waiting. We are waiting for a witch. Oh, is this a witch? Oh god, no, it's just unsavory Charlton. Alright, as long as you don't steal my car, I don't have a problem. Come on, witchy. Witch, witch, witch. Witch, witch is witch. Come on. Oh, did the lady we were talking to leave? Aw. That's so depressing. Well, did we at least become friends with her? Please tell me we got something. Oh no, <laughs> not even. Not even that. So we wasted a few some hours here. That's cool. That's really cool. I think, I'm thinking, I want to end this part here. I think apartment life itself will probably be ending within the next two or three parts just because there's nothing really left to do. But, you know, because if we can't find a witch, what are we really doing anymore? They, they live in a house. There's nothing really being shown with apartments. I just got robbed. I just got robbed. No. Boy. We're gonna do whatever fisticuffs is. Where are you going, fool? Where are you going? Where you think you're going? Fisticuffs. So can I do the fisticuffs? Can I not do that anymore? Alright, well you know what? We're gonna dump the happy log on you. What's dump happy log? I don't know what that means. Fine, well screw that. We're deleting you. You don't deserve to live. Bye. <laughs> I am so rude. I literally just control deleted a guy, didn't I? Oops. Well, it doesn't seem like a witch is gonna come, so I'm just gonna drive home. It's 1 a.m. He's gotta go to his family. They're probably worried. So I'm gonna end the part here, guys. Hopefully you all enjoyed this a very, very weird part of apartment life. I mean, which part isn't weird? Continue to leave your suggestions down below of what you want to see, and that is just about it. Goodbye, humans.